Alright, welcome back to more Strong Bad's Cool Game for Awesome People. I'm Orwa Usopp, and I th think I may be trying to record in HD at this point. Mm, I think I see something! Mm, I can't quite reach it! Dear Strong Let Bad, me try. how you reach through My arms are longer and stickier! How you reach through a hole no, with boxing gloves for hands? Oh, Yikes! Oh, it's a bear holding a shark! Look out, Ronaldo! It's a western lowland grizzly sharkosaurus bot! And it's holding a shark! Help! I'm trapped! Uh-oh. Okay, you prehistoric hunk of advanced technology! Prepare to become extinct and obsolete, respectively! Wait, how do you kill one of these things? Same way you kill anything else. Violence! Yay! <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, <coughs> yay violence. Good thing there are two Sorry. sides to this every time of gun. Year. Killed my yay violence line. Take that. And this. Oh, is that your liver? Well, here's my fist. Boot to the head. To the head. Yay. And one for Jenny and the Wimp. Hell yeah. What happened to the monster? I didn't even have to make the joke. He's history. And biology. And a little metal shop. Did you get the formula? Oh no! I must have grabbed it too hard! It's turned to dust! Ronaldo! The formula? Not to worry! I know someone who can help! But you're not gonna like it! And hey! You don't mean! That's right! Deranged rocket scientist Professor Experimental! Oh, that'll do. Fine. How could I forget? That whack job got me kicked out of the space program back in 83! Well, he's experiments. made a lot of scientific-ish advances in formula reproduction. He could probably recreate Cutesy Button's rainforest formula if you bring him some of this powdery goop! Powder and goop are kind of exclusive in my opinion, eh? But hey, that's mm, my... The good professor's secret lab won't be so secret from me after I add it to my GSPTK! Uh, let's put it up here. It's a nice part of the world. But first, let's check our rank. Oh, I thought I ranked up since I was a dead informant. That kind of sucks. Alright. Well, let's head to the secret lab. Hey, our fun machine. Did he just throw safety stuff? Freeze, at scumbag! Put down the science and get up against the wall! Hey, hey, hey! Come on now, just everybody relax! We're here for a favor! Safety scissors, yep. You gotta be more careful, Ronaldo. These things could have punctured your melon, and you only have two weeks till retirement. Oh, you know you can squeeze my head to tell if I'm fresh. I did not need to know that. At all. Fine! I didn't want to touch your stupid science any dang way. Bubble, 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 bubble. Bubble Bobble. Bubblecular. Rocket simulator. Space flight simulation. For when you can't blow that ball up that tube for long enough to be a real astronaut. Hmm. Yet another Vitelectrix classic. Space Circus Catastrophe. Rescue Bubble with Z and shoot lasers with X. Okay. We That was Whoa! scary. Hello? Oh, crap sickles. I thought I could save a peanut. No! What am I doing wrong here? Rescued. I suck. Saved ya! Saving lives and kissing wives, dangerous. Ow, what the hell? Yay, I beat the level. I passed Pluto. Alright. Is this supposed to be fun? You're welcome, spaceman! I hit the stupid button. Gotcha! Invasive maneuvers! Nope. I'm dead. Wow. 
in just continuing tradition, these games aren't very good. Blah. Ruby Rocket. Ruby Powered Rocket. I ordered one of these from the back of a comic book once. Only the ruby was plastic. And the rocket was a toilet paper roll. And the comic book was a napkin. <laughs> and in this case, the ruby appears to be a... Ring pop. Oh, check out the size of that ruby. Don't worry, I'm not gonna steal it. I'm just saying. Pretty big ruby. Alright, I'm experimento face. You know what? You threw scissors at me. You're a jerk. You see this? This nunchuck gun says I mean business. And I don't mean investment banking. I mean the other kind of business you do with the firearm. Just so you know. And you know what? We better threaten you just for good measure because you're here. Now is no time for violence! Just kidding. Any time is a good time for violence. But I do have more important things to do right now. Oh, alright, fine. So, I hear you've become an expert in making formulas, huh? Not exactly the nastiest thing you could say, Strongman. So I guess your area of expertise is in... baby formula, right? Because you're a baby? Lame. Oh, come on. You totally set me up for that one. Nope. You were reaching like some kind of guy who's reaching really far. I gotta say, you turned out okay, Experimento. At least you're not still trying to contact hot alien races in the hopes of interplanetary prom dates. He looks a little bit... Oh, right. That was me. Prom. So, you're some kind of expert on formulas now, huh? Yep. It's been made clear. Okay, mister, you can't take a plastic bag full of scorpions into space. What's it gonna take to get you to recreate this top secret formula for me? Somebody stole a disk of important launch codes for your rocket and you want me to get them back? That's what I heard. That sounds fair. I heard he wanted us to you get me lawn. my formula and I'll find your disk. Okay, fine. Get to work, buddy boy. Purple, bubble, purple, bubble, 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 bubble. What is it? What's going on? Ronaldo, what is he bubbling about? It's ingredients. He's figuring out what he needs to make the formula. A bubbly liquid, a flower from the rare stick and e tree, and some yellow hair? Mm. Nice job. Looks like we'll be scouring the streets of Brain Blow City tonight. Yellow hair. Okay. Now we just need to shave the cheat. I can't believe Brain Blow City isn't a default location in my travel log. I better add it now. Alright, let's head to the big city on the coast. Brain Blow City. A town as hard as steel and twice as gray. She's like a fine lady type. Treat her right, and she'll make you cupcakes shaped like cold ones. But treat her wrong. And she'll kick you in the knees, step on your face with a stiletto heel, take your wallet, and totally ruin your credit Dang. score! Yeah, your woman, your scares, woman me. scares me! I'll just wait here by the wall where it's safe. You go on ahead! Wow, wow. Hmm, time to explore this gritty city. I heard a rumor that Brain Blow City is the only place left in the world where the rare stick a knee tree can be found. That's fantastic! That means we won't have to travel the globe for this case like we did back in 91, when we were on the trail of the Two-Legged Man! The yeah, two I guess I really man. didn't think that one through too carefully. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I think you needed a uh, little more information other than Two-Legged Man. Seriously, guy. I'm not your guy, buddy. Brain Blow Prison. Visiting hours? Not now. Visiting hours? Not now. I'm not really interested in having a face-to-face -face with guys I sent to the pokey anyway. They do not like it when I call it the pokey. Ah, the old Brain Blow City Prison. I can't tell you how many times I've broken in and out of this place. Seriously, I can't tell you. I'm under a gag order from the courts. Okay. Doesn't look that hard to escape from. Seriously. Bars or toilet paper? Rainbow Blow City Limits. 
Okay. That's not good. There we go. The stickany tree. The rare stickany. Looks like this was the last flower on the last tree. Good thing I got that Lorax framed for murder. You monster! This must be the rare stickany flower that Professor Experimento needs for the formula. I'll just carefully remove this last delicate blossom. I was sure there would somehow be an alarm on it. It does look kind of plain now. There's some dead branches hanging off. Well, I hope you're happy with yourself, Mr. Murder. Ooh, a shark pond. Man, those sure are some way under the water sharks. That we can't see. How convenient. Ooh, what's that? We can't reach it, probably. I can't quite reach it! So shoot it down. Interrogating inanimate objects isn't as helpful as you might think. Idiot. Just whack it down. Cool car. My trusty Dange car ask. I've just had all its cool gadgets upgraded to cool, cool gadgets. Be patient, my high performance pal. Your time to shine will come soon enough. Foreshadowing! We all know that car doesn't run. It's been sitting here there in the middle of the field since the first game. Alright. Hmm. Well, we've got our rare flower. Now we just needed some yellow hair. Since we haven't seen it a cheat, we only know one yellow haired where one yellow haired person is. Speaking of. I'm not using that on myself. Besides, I probably wouldn't even feel it. I think you're supposed to be able to threaten everybody at certain points. Freeze! No! Yep. <laughs> I never get tired of that. Freeze! Hey, don't point that thing at me. Lucky thing you're my meal ticket, lady. I'll spare you. This time. So what, you just randomly threaten people like that? Like, okay, you really gonna... Oh well, I'm the one who told you to do it. Arms and legs dealer. We've got one unicyc... Unis, unicyclops. <laughs> one cyclops... Eyepiece. Hello? Commissioner? Do what to a rabbit? You got the wrong number, pal. I'm not in that business anymore. I don't want to know! I don't want to know! I don't want to know! Stupid telemarketers! I don't want to know. I so very don't want to know. The moody lighting and smoky atmosphere are being brightened too much by this plant. Maybe I should take it out for some fresh air and water. Okay, he is looking a little pale in here. Perhaps some sunlight would do him good. I know just the spot. Yes, I do. I know the perfect spot for this plant. A spot that could use a little brightening up. Let's go ahead and get the whale on our map. There we go. Let's throw it to the sharks. Okay, stupid plant. Can you swim? Because you're about to get watered! There we go. Now we've got our little side distraction set up. So we should get her to look out the window. Hey, cutesy buttons. Why don't you take a look out the window? Shouldn't you be out getting my formula instead of hanging around the office? No, seriously. Marzipan. I think you should look out the window. Ay, Credenza! What have they done to you? Hang in there, little one. Oh, that's just mean. Yes, it is, but we need the hair. Got it! You go get Credenza right now, or I'll... You'll what? Ow. I rescued your plan from those bloodthirsty sharks. Or er, leaf-thirsty. Thank you, Dangerous. Now, I think you should keep looking for that formula. Yeah, it's safer out there with the sharks anyway. He doesn't bleed, I notice. His face has no blood. 
He's some kind of zombie! Strong bad zombie! I always knew it! Alright. Let's turn in this gunk. Uh, yellow hair. Okay, here you go. But man, you know what I had to go through to snip off Blondie's hair? That's right. So, uh, how's that formula coming there? We've only given him one ingredient, stupid. Alright, now we'll go with some diet brown for a bubbly hey, drink. Hey, look at that! I happen to have a carbonated liquid right here. Man, I'm good. I know it looks delicious, but it tastes more like one of Ronaldo's old gym socks. And trust me, you do not want to know how I became familiar with that particular taste sensation. Someone else hates diet okay, pepper you almost got as your much bubbly drink. Now make what the formula make. Ing. He doesn't have all the ingredients, Reynaldo. Here it is. A one-of-a-kind biogenetic miracle flower with the potential to eliminate sickness and disease from the surface of the planet forever and ever. I'll grind it into a goopy paste so I can take it back to some nerdy dame and get myself paid. Go science. It's the formula! He's done it, Danger. Well, looks like we've solved the game! Okay, Yay! Okay, Experimento. Me and you, we's cool. Well, Pom Pom's cool. Let's get this crap back to cutesy buttons! To the dangerous cave! I mean, office. To my office. <laughs> yes, to the office. But I think we'll probably go there next time. I'll see you soon. Unless it turns out this is only like 12 minutes long. In this case, I'll be right back. But I think I'll be back soon. You know. Alright, bye-bye.